holiday and more. Good evening, I'm Jackie Brambles and Monday's Most Wanted is on the way. This is Greatest Hits Radio on FM, DAB, Smart Speaker and now playing on Rayo. Across bucks, beds and hearts. This is Greatest Hits Radio. top stories this hour. An 18-year-old has appeared in court charged with the murder of a woman and two children in Luton. Nicholas Prosper, who's from Lee Banks, also been charged with a number of other offences related to the murders of 48-year-old Juliana Prosper, as well as her children Giselle and Kyle Prosper, who were 13 and 16. Our reporter Zoe Head Thomas is in Lee Bank for us. Earlier today, a group of teenagers sat on the grass in front of the building holding each other's while a neighbour played music from their balcony. I've also seen police and community support officers circling the area as neighbours tell me how they've been affected. People that didn't know them directly, yeah. it's devastated everyone. Um, and you just can't believe it's happened really. We? No. You know of someone and you just don't ever expect it so to happen, do you? You don't think. Well, we know that one of the victims attended Cardinal Newman Catholic School, where priests are now visiting their classmates. Kevin McGinnell is the Catholic Dean of Luton and Dunstable Pastoral Area. There's a lot of support going into there. The students and the staff who knew him so well will be very hurt by what's happened. Prospo is due in court again on Wednesday as the community here come to terms with their loss. A former BBC News reader, Hugh Edwards, has been spurred prison after admitting to accessing indecent images of children as young as seven. The 63-year-old was sent 41 illegal images by convicted paedophile Alex Williams. The Italian Prime Minister has confirmed that Sakia Starmer is interested in her country's asylum deal with Albania. Rome's intending to progress migrants there. A man suspected of trying to assassinate Donald Trump has appeared in court in Florida. Ryan Routh was shackled and wearing a blue jumpsuit. MK Dons have appointed Neil Hart as their new chief exec. He joins Dons from Bolton Wanderers where he won League One CEO of the Year. And Manchester City could be expelled from the Premier League. A landmark hearing's now begun into their alleged breaches of financial fair play rules. They deny any wrongdoing. Weather on Greatest Hits Radio. The UK's most listened to commercial radio station. Dry, clear and pretty chilly tonight across Books, Beds and Hearts. Lows around 10 degrees, then fine and warm tomorrow with plenty of sun. That's the latest. I'm Cameron Green. Evening all, let's kick off Monday's Most Wanted playlist with Madonna. And you can dance.